Guys, in this video, I'm going to show you my $5,000 plus food delivery business setup. First, this is my right. It is a Mazda pickup truck. It is a B2500. It, you know, it is a 1999 model. So it is not new, but you know, to be honest with you, your car doesn't have to be fancy. As long as it works, you know, that's good enough. Over here, you can see I have bags to make sure I keep the the foot hat I got uh, I normally carry around I believe five to seven bags because you know when I have an opportunity to do multi-upping I do it so I make sure that uh, you know I have enough bags now in the inside over here I have a two phone setup I have an iPhone 13 which is this one right here and then I have an iPhone 10. This is actually the 13 Pro Max. You do not, you do not need a fancy phone, but I got this one because you know I also you know shoot um, shoot YouTube videos, and I do a lot of different things online. So this one works great for me. Um, now to be able to you know to hold this setup, I use different cases. This one right here, I'm using what is called the Rock form. And what I like about this case is that it comes with a magnum. You see, I put a magnum right here on the um, um, on the air condition fans because when it has it has sometimes the iPhones you know overheat and you cannot use it. And with this case in the magnum, all I need to do is sting and stick straight into the magnum. Now for the iPhone 13, I have a different setup. I'm using an Arobo case with the Quad Lock Universal Lock. And I'm using also a quad lock car mount with a quad lock wireless char uh, charger. So every time I need to, I am in a hurry and I need to, you know, put the phones in the car because, you know, I need to see directions or I need to, you know, head to the restaurant or deliver the, co uh, the food. Then with this phone, all I need to do is just click it. It clicks and you can see it right here. It starts charging right away. So this is a great setup set up for you know this type of setup with two forms now with this phone i also have another uh, uh, rock form uh, case with another magnet in case it gets too hot because over here i am in pond spring so it gets really hot so i can put it on the other fence so but this is the setup uh, now i want to show you what i'm running on this phone right here i have one doordash account i have one uber eats account and i have one grow hop account right i'm running three apps on this phone now on this phone on my second phone let me open it for you so i can show you i have uber eats account i have doordash i have grow hop and i also have instacart and ship so sometimes you know if i need to i don't know if you can see it Sometimes if I if I slow I can do Instacart or I can do shift or if I get a great offer, you know, I stop and doing food delivery and I do this this too. Depends on the offer if it's like a good unicorn. For this one, like I showed you, I have Grow Hop, DoorDash, Uber Eats, and this one only have the uh, food delivery uh, forms. Now, this is a great setup. Now for the cable, I have the last cable, but sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. So normally I use the cable that comes with the iPhone. And for this one, I had the wireless, but in this bag, I have like, you can see right here, I have the last cable if I need to change it. And I also have an extra, an extra Apple cable, just in case something happens to the quad lock and, uh, you know, and stop charging. Or sometimes, you know, the quad lock charge, but it's not strong enough. So what I do is that I also plug the other cable until the phone gets to 100% and then I use the quad lock. Um, you know, sometimes, you know, I do it like that. So all depends. I hope you guys like this video. This, like I showed you, is my $5,000 plus food delivery setup. And if you, want, if you guys want to learn my tricks and tips that I use to be able to make $5,000 plus every month do a food delivery, at the end of this video, I'm going to leave a playlist. The playlist contains my best ride-alongs on how I do food delivery. Now, these videos, I try to keep it real, I try to keep it raw, so I do, I do not do any fancy editing, and I try not to cut, you know, the, uh, a lot of part of the videos. So I hope you guys like this video. Guys, make sure you subscribe and hit the bell notification icon. This is Carlos, and I will see you on the next video.